And Mr. Waller was 61 years old when he passed away yesterday morning, and everyone I spoke to today highlighted his hard work and his dedication to his students. You know, it's difficult on the staff, and of course, we all have relationships with Mr. Walter to some of us long, much longer than others. Uh, it's difficult for the students as far as their relationship with Mr. Walter. Mr. Waller was getting ready to teach his 26th year. He started fighting cancer in March of 2021. His attitude toward it was like, you know, I'm just going to take it on, and I'm going to continue to live life and, and be strong, and he showed that even in the classroom and what he did here at the school over the summer. Mr. Waller was working on his mum farm all throughout the summer. Staff members say that there are more than 4,000 mums. The students, you know, want to go forward, and, and that's what Mr. Waller would want. And, um, of course, that's a testimony to the agricultural families and industry. Mr. Waller found a way to stay close to his students. I know that he touched a lot of lives and a lot of hearts and, you know, our prayers go with them. And this is going to be a very hard time for a lot of people, even the students that he's teaching now. He was my biggest supporter and cheerleader alongside my parents. And he just, um, he just meant a lot to me. Now, coming up at six, find out how Mr. Waller was there for one of those former students when her father passed away when she was in high school. Reporting live in the floor, Jacob Murphy, 4029 News.